Welcome to English Learning Club. Listen carefully. I was in a new city. Everything was unfamiliar. The streets were busy, and people were in a hurry. I needed to find the bus station, but I was lost. I decided to ask someone for help. I saw a man standing near a shop. He looked friendly, so I walked up to him. My heart was beating fast. Speaking English made me nervous, but I knew I had to try. Excuse me, I said, can you help me, please? The man smiled. Sure, he replied. What do you need? I'm looking for the bus station, I said, trying to sound calm. Can you tell me how to get there? He nodded and pointed down the street. Go straight for two blocks, he said. Then, turn left at the big red building. The bus station is right there, I the directions in my head, two blocks straight, then left at the red building. It seemed easy enough, repeated, thank you so much, I said, feeling relieved. I'm looking for the bus station, I said, trying to sound calm. Can you tell me how to get there? He nodded and pointed down the street. Go straight for two blocks, he said. Then, turn left at the big red building. The bus station is right there, I the directions in, no problem, he replied. Have a good day, I walked in the direction he showed me. After a few minutes, I saw the big red building. I turned left, and there it was, the bus station. I felt proud of myself. I had asked. Interesting vocabulary and expressions. Unfamiliar, not frequently seen, heard, or experienced. Example, he gets nervous when he is in unfamiliar surroundings. Proud, very happy and pleased because of something you have done, something you own, someone you know or are related to, etc. Feeling pride, example, they are the proud parents of a hero. Turned, expressed in a proper or skillful way, example, a well-turned phrase. Repeated, said, done, or happening again and again, example, the landlord ignored her repeated requests to have the stove repaired. Directions, the course or path on which something is moving or pointing, example, the army attacked from three different directions. Straight, not having curves, bends, or angles, example, a straight line, slash edge. Excuse, to forgive someone for making a mistake, doing something wrong, etc., example, please excuse, equals pardon, my clumsiness. Relieved, feeling relaxed and happy because something difficult or unpleasant has been stopped, avoided, or made easier, feeling relief, example, I was relieved to hear that you're feeling better. Excuse, to forgive someone for making a mistake, doing something wrong, etc., example, please excuse my clumsiness. Now it's time to practice. I was in a new city. I was in a new city. Everything was unfamiliar. Everything was unfamiliar. The streets were busy, and people were in a hurry. The streets were busy, and people were in a hurry. I needed to find the bus station. I needed to find the bus station, but I was lost. I decided to ask someone for help, but I was lost. I decided to ask someone for help. I saw a man standing near a shop. I saw a man standing near a shop. He looked friendly, so I walked up to him. He looked friendly, so I walked up to him. My heart was beating fast. My heart was beating fast. Speaking English made me nervous. Speaking English made me nervous, but I knew I had to try. Excuse me. But I knew I had to try. Excuse me. I said, can you help me, please? I said, can you help me, please? The man smiled. The man smiled. Sure, he replied. Sure, he replied. What do you need? What do you need? I'm looking for the bus station, I said, trying to sound calm. I'm looking for the bus station, I said, trying to sound calm. Can you tell me how to get there? He nodded and pointed down the street. Can you tell me how to get there? He nodded and pointed down the street. Go straight for two blocks. Go straight for two blocks, he said. Then, turn left at the big red building, he said. Then, turn left at the big red building. The bus station is right there, I the directions in my head. The bus station is right there, I the directions in my head, two blocks straight, then left at the red building. Two blocks straight, then left at the red building. 
It seemed easy enough, repeated. It seemed easy enough, repeated, thank you so much, I said, feeling relieved. Thank you so much, I said, feeling relieved. I'm looking for the bus station, I said, trying to sound calm. I'm looking for the bus station, I said, trying to sound calm. Can you tell me how to get there? Can you tell me how to get there? He nodded and pointed down the street. He nodded and pointed down the street. Go straight for two blocks. Go straight for two blocks, he said. Then, turn left at the big red building. He said. Then, turn left at the big red building. The bus station is right there, I the directions in. The bus station is right there, I the directions in, no problem, he replied. No problem, he replied. Have a good day. Have a good day, I walked in the direction he showed me. I walked in the direction he showed me. After a few minutes, I saw the big red building. After a few minutes, I saw the big red building. I turned left, and there it was, the bus station. I turned left, and there it was, the bus station. I felt proud of myself. I had ask. I felt proud of myself. I had ask. Listen to the story carefully one more time. I was in a new city. Everything was unfamiliar. The streets were busy, and people were in a hurry. I needed to find the bus station, but I was lost. I decided to ask someone for help, I saw a man standing near a shop. He looked friendly, so I walked up to him. My heart was beating fast. Speaking English made me nervous, but I knew I had to try, excuse me, I said, can you help me, please, the man smiled. Sure, he replied. What do you need? I'm looking for the bus station, I said, trying to sound calm. Can you tell me how to get there? He nodded and pointed down the street. Go straight for two blocks, he said. Then, turn left at the big red building. The bus station is right there, I the directions in my head, two blocks straight, then left at the red building. It seemed easy enough, repeated, thank you so much, I said, feeling relieved. I'm looking for the bus station, I said, trying to sound calm. Can you tell me how to get there? He nodded and pointed down the street. Go straight for two blocks, he said. Then, turn left at the big red building. The bus station is right there, I the directions in, no problem, he replied. Have a good day, I walked in the direction he showed me. After a few minutes, I saw the big red building. I turned left, and there it was, the bus station. I felt proud of myself. I had ask. Thank you for watching my video. Please like, comment and subscribe.